Okay, today we're reviewing the Boone Forge Camping Hatchet. This is a multi-purpose hatchet. You can see we've got a lot going on here, a lot of parts to review. Uh, so let's jump right into it. So when you think of a traditional hatchet that you're going to take into the woods with you, whether you're camping or hiking, you're thinking of a, a hickory handle with a large uh, ax head or hatchet head on it. And those are great for chopping small trees and things like that. But you can see some of the advantages here. Um, this is gonna be more for saplings and for finer work, uh, but you can see you're gonna have a lot less weight carrying this around, especially on your side. Uh, a hatchet's gonna have to go into a pack or something like that. Whereas Boone Forge uh, gives you this sheath and that fits right on there. And you can see there's a belt loop on the back. So I'm able to put that on my belt and carry that with me throughout the woods. And it's very convenient. Just loose the uh, uh, Velcro strap and then this is gonna come right out of that sheet. Um, also, what you're gonna notice is that this is a one piece full tang solid steel construction. So as you see, the head continues down through the handle. I'll show you the back side of it here and uh, all the way to the end and around. So this is one solid piece. So there's no head to go flying off after a few years of usage um, because it's all one piece of steel. Next thing is you'll notice the handle. So this ergonomic handle, I'm gonna get a close up of it here so you can see the grip and the texture of that. So they really did a good job of putting the finger grooves right here and then a full, I mean, I, I've got more than enough room on here for my hand and I can tell you that while I'm holding this it fills the hand it feels really good uh, working with it and uh, again you can see that non-slip grip handle is going to allow you to do all kinds of work without fatiguing your hand and without it slipping out of your hand another advantage compared to a traditional hatchet or something like that so let's look at the other things that a traditional hatchet isn't going to be able to do so uh one of the very obvious first things that you see is the head we've got some hex holes there and these are for your most common size fasteners so uh you know if you're riding an atv uh or or any type of vehicle or a bike uh, or anything that you would come across any type of equipment out in the field or around the farm or something like that you oftentimes need some type of a, a wrench or a, a adjustable wrench or a socket set or something like that just to loose loosen a rusty bolt or something like that so you can see what I've got here just okay fits in there like that um, you can see the other side the hex head of the bolt fits in there like that. So I think we've got, uh, this This one's gonna fit like 16 millimeter and uh, 5 8 inch. This one's gonna do 14 millimeter and uh, 9 16 inch. But you know, basically what you're gonna find and come across in the field is the most common size fasteners. You've got that there. Again, an advantage that you don't have with a traditional hatchet if you've got it with you. The other thing uh, compared to a traditional hatchet is just the amount of fine uh, carving work and so forth, I'm able to do with this super sharp curved blade, as you can see here. Um, so I'm able to do that uh, feather stick kind of work and whittling, and I can choke up on this. And you can see it's got a nice place for my thumb here as I uh, really dig in and start to do that fine uh, work like that. I'm able to feather stick with this. So uh, really replaces the, the uh, need for an ax, but any kind of whittling or anything that you have to do like that, uh, you can do that and it's gonna make short work of it uh, as well. The next thing is that you see is very different is the gut hook right here. So what's great about that gut hook, okay, you can see it, is you've got that sharp point on there. Now I'm able to process game with this uh, so that when I kill a, an animal, I'm able to take this under the uh, fur and I'm able to pull that and draw that towards me and open that uh, harvested animal up very nicely. The other thing that uh, people don't realize is when you're out in the woods, you, you're always coming across all kinds of stuff that needs to be cut and sometimes like twine and small rope and you can use this or vines off of uh, trees. Uh, so again, if I'm coming into the woods and I'm finding some twine or if I had twine that I was using for some kind of rigging or something on my tent or anything like that, I'm able to put that in there like that and you can see how easily you're gonna be able to do small paracord as well. Um, 
okay? Anything like that that you need to uh, open up. So uh, some very unique differences that you're gonna see in this and benefits compared to a traditional hatchet. Um, but let's see with this nice curved blade here, how this chops. Okay, so you're gonna find with this great grip that we've got on here, just processing any kind of firewood, um, twigs, anything that you have to do is gonna be so easy with this. Okay, as you can see. And, uh, but let's look at things like uh, rope. So here we've got some manila rope. Okay, and you see how well that cuts. All right, and uh, yeah, it's just, it's got a nice sharp blade to it. Uh, you know, you're gonna do things with this that you really couldn't do with a traditional hatchet. Um, here's your paracord. So again, same thing. It's gonna cut right through it. So makes real short work of all the jobs that you're gonna have to do around the camp. Okay, so as you can see, this is gonna do all the tasks that you need around the camp for a hatchet, for a sharp knife, for that fine woodworking that you're gonna to have to do. Uh, just in case you come across anywhere where you need fasteners to be loosened or tightened, you've got that as a backup as well. Um, you know, you saw the chopping feature. What's gonna be great about this, as I was mentioning, big game. Um, a lot of times you'll have a bone saw in your pack um, so that you can, if you've got an elk or a moose that you've got a quarter and get out of the forest, um, you're able to use this because I would rather use a hatchet um, than a bone saw. A bone saw is going to leave uh, all the fine dust that you're cutting through the bone, uh, whereas a hatchet, I can quarter a large animal much easier, especially with this one. I couldn't do that with a traditional hatchet uh, because of how wide the head is, but when you see how thin this is, how straight it is, how ergonomic the handle is and uh, easy to be able to uh, chop with and keep a firm grip on it as well. You've really got a great tool uh, for hunting, camping, hiking, uh, and everything like that. So you can find Boon Forge items on Amazon if you search for uh, Boon Forge. Uh, also, I'll leave a link somewhere in the description on this page so that you can uh, access and see all of their products, which include more outdoor camping, hunting, bushcraft products like this, as well as throwing knives, throwing tomahawks, and uh, items like that. You're gonna find they're very good quality and uh, they're made so that they can last for years and years. All right, hope you like this review and uh, please leave a comment below.